So the guy we are showing you here is absolutely ridiculous. Him being fake is so blatant that I can't imagine who is falling for this super clown. It's so so bad. But two reasons we take a look at him anyhow. Number one, there are definitely a few victims already, so he needs to get exposed. And number two, he is doing many of the typical ways fake trading or betting YouTubers are trying to present themselves as being successful. And we can clearly point them out here as it's so obvious. Other scammers are more clever and not so obvious as our prime example of a fake betting guru here. But if you have seen these strategies once, you will easily recognize them anywhere else. So let's have a laugh at him. <laughs> Look at this picture. I mean, <laughs> if your alarm bells are not going off here already, there must be something wrong with you. It's an Austrian guy. It says entrepreneur, coach, sports betting bro. Now, what you always should do when you visit a fake guru channel, sort the videos by oldest first. What you will often see is that these fake gurus come out of nothing and instantly showing off a lavish lifestyle. They try fancy cars and the underlying message should be Look at me, I'm successful. If you want to live my lifestyle, follow me. The most famous example of that so-called fake it till you make it scheme is Ty Lopez. One of his first videos was the now infamous here in my garage video. So Ty Lopez wasn't successful at all in what he did before, but he rented a mansion and a Lamborghini to show off. And it worked. And it worked for many other fake gurus as well. Look at Graham Stephan for example. It's just ridiculous. This guy was simply an employed real estate agent at that time. I repeat, employed but starts his channel flashing cars and people falling for it. But back to our friend here. He starts his channel with a trailer called The Wolf of Sports Betting, where it is exactly what I just described. His videos usually don't have many views, but this one has more than 200,000. It's likely because he lets it run as an ad on YouTube. We can see him with an expensive car, and on a boat. And we actually see him in front of his computer with a betting page open. What is it? <laughs> bet365. You are not a betting professional if you bet on Bet365. We also see him at a betting terminal at his local bookie or sports bar. It's probably Admiral Bet, an Austrian bookie, as he is flashing betting slips throughout the video. Absolutely ridiculous. Of course he has his own website where he wants to sell you his expertise. And again we can see him betting on Bet365. <laughs> what a loser. What is he promising? Let's have it translated to English. In a short time you will earn more than in your job, so that you can hang up your job in the medium term. You can use your newly gained freedom for yourself, your family, your friends and your hobbies. Or travel the world. Due to the small amount of time you spend, you can organize most of your day freely without being tied to a job for hours every day. He is a head coach and will help you and show you how you can earn 4 to 5 figures per month with sports betting. What a scumbag! Then his content. You can't even call it bullshit, because it's just nothing. If you check the videos, there is nothing substantial there. Absolutely nothing. For example, he has a short video about correct money management, at least it says so in the title, but in it, there's nothing about money management at all. Nothing at all! Then of course he also has some fake idiot customers, who supposedly are making thousands of betting thanks to his help. To fall for this guy, you have to be almost monkey level dumb. Fortunately, he doesn't seem to be very successful on YouTube yet, but make no mistake and overestimate the intelligence of the dumbest YouTube viewers and how fast a channel like that could become successful. All it needs for him is to get his channel to a decent size, and idiots interested in sports betting will start flocking to it. I've seen that happening multiple times with trading YouTubers. A small channel and you think, no way people will follow that loser. And a year later there are 10,000 subscribers. 
Let's hope that will never happen to this imposter. We will keep an eye on him. It should be clear by now that he doesn't fulfill any of our demands we have for YouTube traders. Number one, long-term trading records. Well, no trading or betting records presented. Number two, reputable platform. He was only showing soft bookies. So even if he showed some kind of betting records from them, soft bookies by definition will quickly limit your betting after you won a few thousands. So there's no way you can win more than that, even if you are very sophisticated. Number three, teaching a strategy, proof its validity. Well, he doesn't teach or show a strategy on YouTube. He will probably teach you something extremely simple if you book his service, something which will make you lose money. Number four, certification by an independent party. He doesn't show his track record, so of course there is also no certification for that. Always stay skeptical and demand unfortunate evidence from anyone who claims to be successful and wants to sell you his success formula. This clown is certainly a loser. I can guarantee you with 100% certainty that he does not earn his living with clever sports betting. Until next time. If you are intrigued, subscribe to our channel and you are welcome to ask us questions and give us feedback and comments.